lots of music like punk rock or heavy metal or some pop or something. Probably metal because I usually like anything with a fast guitar. I don't really have a kind of favorite music. I listen to anything, well, except country. My favorite kind of music has to be like uh, older country and yeah, older country, some hip hop and metal. My favorite kind of music is music that really has a meaning to it. Reggae, a little bit of hip hop, people who really express themselves through music. When I'm singing, I feel very empowered, uh, mostly because it's to uh, help a dance. Uh, we have a lot of mass dances in, uh, in our culture in the new culture and uh, all of them are powered by songs and when you're singing and you have a whole group of people, 30 people singing with you, it's just uh, so empowering and it makes that dance much more uh, stronger, it makes it a very good thing to watch. It'd be boring because I'm usually listening to music all hours of the day. If there was no music, I'd be really mad. It would be really boring to live in the world without music. So. Really no sound, I guess, because I'm a, I'm a, I express myself through music. My I think life without music would be really boring because music is uh, it's universal. It brings everybody together. No, no one culture uh, doesn't not like music. Every culture likes music. I don't really think music has a negative, negative effect on life. Just how people think of it. Metallica, Corn, Guns N' Roses, Jesus Priest, is it Three Days Grace? Manowar, Megadeth, Pantera, Children of Bodom, and Three Inches of Blood. I like a lot of native artist performers, a lot of blues, and maybe like Seven Generation, if you heard of them. Uh, I know. like rock, like ACDC, uh, Rolling Stones. And yeah, if I'm like happy or something, I'll listen to like Gwen Stefani, or if I'm really tired, I'll listen to something that's lighter. Like when I'm just like sitting around or something, probably listen to something a bit slower, maybe some like classic rock or something like Led Zeppelin? Not really. Well, sometimes I listen to like, like loud, angry music if I'm like angry and I need to get calmed down. I'm not the only one that's mad and stuff like that. Pretty much that it. Uh, when I just want to mellow out, I listen to some slower country that has like a good beat. But when I want to get like pumped for something I want to do, like a big trick on my bike or a crazy run, I'd listen to some metal or hip hop. Yeah, there's slow beats, like I listen to instrumentals, there's slow beats and beats that make you feel happy, sad beats, angry beats. Jimi Hendrix, and I'd pick that one to see because uh, no one would ever have a chance to see it again. I would like to go to State of Shock. They have good music too there. Makes me feel all happy and stuff like that. I'd say I'd go. I, uh, I think I'd, if I could see any concert, I would most likely see is um, Hank Williams Sr. If I can see any concert, who would it be and why? I'd like to see like an upcoming performer. 
that's never really heard of because I think they got more to say than the, the big people in the music biz. If I was to see a concert, it would it would be a Def Leppard concert. I really wanted to go to one of those. I missed one, unfortunately, last year. But that would be a band I'd like to see. Again, uh, metal. I, I like to listen to it when I'm skateboarding. Like, just have it blasting on the stereo. Um, inspires me. I like, uh, I think the one that really inspires me is just the traditional singing, you know, traditional native singing, because that what encourages me to um, want to learn more songs and compose songs, because I compose songs for my nation. So listening to, listening to all the old singers and all, all different types of native singers really makes me want to work harder at that. Yeah. 